What's going on guys, today I'm bringing you guys another best class setup. Today's class setup revolves around the Honey Badger, but obviously you can use this class setup with any of the weapons that you guys prefer. And if you guys would like me to choose a weapon of your liking to do a best class setup, please feel free to leave it in the comment section below. So now guys, feel free to copy this actual class setup, use it, let me know how it goes in the comment sections down below. And with that said, let's get into this gameplay. What's going on guys, today I'm bringing you all probably one of the best class setups in Call of Duty Ghost. And this class setup revolves around the Honey Badger, but as I said a few seconds ago, you guys can choose this class setup with whatever guns you guys, you know, prefer. Now before I get into this actual class setup, I just want to let you guys know I'm playing some Domination on the map Ignition. I believe I go like 44 and 2, 45 and 2, something along those lines. And the, la the only two times that I actually died were pretty damn stupid if you ask me, but you guys will see for yourselves. Um, uh, the game starts off a little bit slow, but then I go on a total rampage on these kids after I get the helo pilot But anyways getting into this class setup here We have the honey badger assault rifle with the foregrip and the extended mags now if you guys are planning to run this class setup with the actual honey badger I'd personally choose the extended mags and the foregrip because when you put the red dot side on this weapon for some reason The recoil seems a little bit too jumpy for me So I personally just you know prefer to use the extended mags with the actual foregrip because the iron sights on this weapon are just beautiful like you can see everything so honestly there's no need to put a red dot sight but anyways aside from that those are the attachments you got you guys can run whatever attachments you know you guys are comfortable with but those are the ones that I prefer using so now moving into the next part of this class setup is the secondary lethals and tacticals here I never ever 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 put anything because I don't think it's you know that important to have a lethal or tactical or even a secondary weapon in this game because they're not that good you know so I'd rather have an additional three perks in my actual class setup because if you guys ask me it does make a big difference three perks and three additional perks makes a big difference in this game guys all right guys so the first perk up in the list that we have here is ready up now ready up is a very very important perk and it's very cheap it's only one perk slot so therefore it comes in handy so if you guys ever have a little room for this perk make sure to use it it's gonna come in handy so much as we all know ready up it basically allows us to pull up the weapon quicker at least towards our hip and therefore when you do that it's very essential and it's very very important to use it like you guys saw right there you know I pulled up my gun real quick to the hip and then I just hip fired that guy and obviously when you guys hip fire the bullet spread is a lot bigger than if you guys were to just aim down the sight you know to a target that's right in front of you guys so if you guys encounter close you know situations like that where there's somebody coming out of the corner in a closed room right in front of your face make sure you guys take full advantage of that ready up perk and hip fire the crap out of the guy so ready up is definitely an important perk and it obviously complements quick draw which we have also as part of this class setup so ready up and quick draw make a perfect combination now if you guys ask me quick draw i would say it's probably one of the best perks in the game and you know best perk that's ever been on a call of duty game because especially in this game you die so damn quick and it's really important for you guys to have the first bullet on your enemy team you know if you guys are going on a head-on gunfight whoever gets the first bullet will probably have an 80 percent chance of winning that gunfight so quick draw is very important that's why i complement it most of the time with ready up and quick draw the next up the next perk that we have is stalker now stalker serves a lot of purposes in this game one it makes you a harder target to hit so you guys can straight from left to right when you guys are you know being fired at another thing when you guys are trying to aim at a target sometimes you can use stalker towards your advantage to kind of readjust your aim on your target and another advantage that stalker has this is why a lot of people use stalker is you could kind of go, you know, you could turn into corners while aiming down sight and you kind of like slide in the corners because Stalker allows you to stray from left to right a lot quicker than, you know, if you did not have Stalker. So, therefore, Stalker is such an amazing perk, guys, and it is very, very useful. So, if you guys are having trouble and are not using Stalker, I would definitely recommend you guys, you know, throw in Stalker somewhere in your class setup. Now, next up is Dead Silence. I don't care what you're doing, you better put on Dead Silence on all your class setups. That's my opinion. You know, silent footsteps are essential in this game because there's so many people that have headsets, and if you do not have Dead Silence, you know, they're just gonna sound whore you. And what I mean, obviously, you guys might already know, but they're gonna hear you coming from a mile away. And even with Dead Silence, if they have Amplify on, they can still hear you, but if you have Dead Silence on, it's a lot lower than if you did not. So, 
Definitely, guys, put on Dead Silence. I promise you guys, it's going to save you so many more times. And, of course, the last perk in this class setup, guys, is Focus. Focus is the number one perk, and I always put it on all my class setup. If you guys have low KDs and problems with winning gunfights, make sure you guys are putting on Focus on your class setup just because it allows you to focus more on your target. You guys can be going on one-on-one -on -one gunfight, and if you have Focus on... If you get shot at, you know, your aim is not going to go all over the place. Therefore, you're going to be able to stay on target and hopefully get that win for the gunfight. So for the kill streaks, obviously, this is an assault class setup. So we have assault kill streaks. First off, we went with a guard dog at the five kill streak. Second off, then we went with a battle hind, and then we went with the helo pilot. Now make sure you guys are having the helo pilot as your third kill streak if you're running you know on a map that's an empty wide open map kind of like ignition if you guys are running you know a map like flooded or something like that you're most you know you're most likely not gonna get any kills with a helo pilot so you guys can make sure to change that up you know tweak it however you guys like or even if you guys don't get a lot of kills you know you guys don't get a lot of kill streaks or don't go on big kill streaks just make sure you put kill streaks that you're comfortable with make sure you put kill streaks that you know you guys are comfortable with achieving like you guys can go ahead and put probably the satcom the guard dog and then the sentry gun or maybe the satcom you know the guard dog and i don't know the battle hind you know if you guys can get there so it all depends on you obviously this class is extremely extremely 100 percent customizable i'm just giving you guys a ground based setup of what i think works great for me so if you guys do enjoy this class setup please let me know in the comment section below if you guys did try it out if you guys changed anything to this class setup let me know in the comment section below and I'll, I'll be happy to hear your feedback on that so guys i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did enjoy the video please feel to drop a like and for those of you guys who are new to my channel subscribe for more daily content my name is hollow point and i'll see you guys on the next video What?